welcome to the sixth stitch this is Michelle and I am going to be giving you kind of an oversight of an issue that we might be having with one of our new EUCs behind me this is mine it's the Kingsong 16x and we just bought it from eWheels um, and they've been phenomenal this is not in any ways um, I'm not gonna throw that company under the bus but we have, um, I was putting pads on it, so I've got it on a, on paint cans. I've got it up on a stand, and I've only rode the unit for about just under four miles. I think I have like 3.6 miles logged on it. The battery is still well at like 90% from receiving it from shipment, so it's super brand new. So I was putting some pads on it to protect it and this is just some padding right here that we have um, because I'm new at writing so occasionally sometimes I do um, kind of drop the unicycle but I'm getting better about like walking out of maybe a potential crash or something so anyways we noticed when we were my husband and I, when we were putting the padding on, and we saw this out of the box too, so this isn't just something we saw just now, but it's more prevalent now, that there's a gap difference in the wheels. And it's kind of hard to show, so I'll turn the camera around, but you can see how that, or not in the wheel, but in the pedal, how that pedal, it's upright, and that pedal is also upright. And this one is touching, and this one doesn't touch. And then there's also a gap difference in the wheel itself, in the unit. And so we think that there might be, it's not that it's out of alignment, but that the um, bar that holds the pedal on, that casing, potentially could be damaged. So we have sent an email to eWheels, but it is the weekend, so I'm not, they're probably not gonna get back to me until tomorrow. And so I'm hoping that you guys can let me know if this is something that is normal and I should just be okay with it. My husband does notice that when he rides the unicycle, he can feel the difference. And he's on a gotway, so his unicycle, his, his has no issues out of the box. But I'll flip the camera around and show you a little bit better view of what I'm dealing with. So let me know in the comments down below after you subscribe to this channel. <laughs> um, is this something that is normal or is this something that maybe should be covered under the warranty? So anyways, thanks for watching this video. Keep writing, be safe, and have a good Christmas.